So guys, we're back with another storage video. Hey, we're going to be evaluating all the weapons and their damage, as well as some combos that you can land with them, and best way to utilize each weapon as well. And by that, I mean all of these weapons right here, from the knife, frying pan, baseball, katana, claymore, and fire axe, they have the same attack pattern combo, and the sledgehammer is different. So it's all of those, all these weapons here versus the attack pattern for the sledgehammer and we're going to see which one overall outputs the most damage but first i want to start out with their base damage what the regular attack damage does and then what the heavy attack does so here we have the weakest of the weapons let's include fist into there as well so for the fists for the regular attack we got fix and then if we do a heavy attack that's 10. going to the knife we have Eight, another heavy attack, 14. Now this, the new weapon that just came out, the frying pan, it is a bit better than the knife, as you can see here. Nine base attack, and 15 for the heavy. And right above that, above the frying pan, is the baseball bat. Doing 10 base damage, and 17 for the heavy attack. And then right above that is the katana, which does leap and damage with 12 and 20 for the heavy attack. Now we have the new weapon, Claymore, which you can buy from the king, and I was told can be dropped by the mummified king as well, but I'm not too sure, as I've only received the king's crown every time I've killed him. So let me know if you've gotten Claymore from the mummified king when you've killed him in the comments below. All right, so for the base attack, does 15, so three more than the katana, that's pretty good. And then the heavy attack does 22 versus the 20 in the katana. So it is superior to the katana. And then above that, and arguably the best weapon per damage potential is the fire axe with a base attack of 15. So the claymore and the fire axe both have the same base damage at 15 but for the fire axe the heavy attack does 25 instead of 22 so if you're a player that relies on heavy attacks more than regular base attacks the fire axe is your weapon and if you only rely on heavy attacks then the sledgehammer is your weapon because if we look here the base attack does 26 Versus the 15, so that's already 11 damage more just for the base. And then a heavy attack does 35 versus the 25 for the fire axe. Now, the special thing between all these weapons, from the knife, frying pan, baseball bat, katana, claymore, and fire axe, you can do three regular attacks followed up with two heavy attacks in a row. Oh. Alright, so to avoid interruptions, like I just closed the garage door. So to recap, for the knife, frying pan, baseball bat, katana, claymore, and fire axe, you can do three basic attacks and two heavy attacks. Alright, you see how it did two heavy attacks in a row? That can happen for the knife, frying pan, baseball bat, katana, and claymore, as well as your fist, of course. But I guess not for the fire axe. I thought it was working for the fire axe before, but... No, it does work for the fire axe. It just doesn't happen all the time with it for some reason. So yeah, for every melee weapon but the sledgehammer, you can do a three basic attacks followed by two heavy attacks. But for the sledgehammer, you can only do one basic attack with two heavy attacks, like so. So, you can insta-kill someone if they don't have armor, but it's tricky to land in actual battle because most people you're trying to kill aren't standing still like this, and you also have to get them in a corner or against a wall to pull that off. Though you can do the same with the fire axe too. Alright, 
Oh, actually, I think overall the sledgehammer does more damage for its own combo versus the fire axe and all the other weapons since the rest do less than the fire axe. So the overall damage potential goes to sledgehammer for its one basic two heavy attack. But in actual combat where people are getting thrown across the floor and they're just running around everywhere, you can't really corner them like you can with this AFK alt account right here.